contestants, messy games, the fun car Grand Prix race, and the crazy chase to win lots of prizes. Now here's the guy who puts the fun into Funhouse, Pat Sharp! I'd like to show you my fun flat, uh, my fun bungalow, uh, all right, my fun house! <laughs> what a start! What a show we have planned for you today, but there are two main stars of this show. They are my assistants, without whom none of this would be possible. Say hello to Melanie and Martina! <laughs> Why don't I get to wear a hat all these years? You would have thought so, eh? Anyway, there are other stars in this show. Without these people, nothing would be possible. Bring on our players! <laughs> so what's with the hat, Governor? Howdy, cowboy. <laughs> Yee-haw! <laughs> That's very good. Where's your horse? Uh, out the bed. Oh, right. That's Just the way you walk. Yeah, okay. Yes, OK. So, who have you got? This is Jessica and Andy from Tunbridge Wells, and they both attend the Mascal School! Yay! All right, that's Martinez Yellows and Mel has. I have Emily and Andrew, and they're from Belfast, and they attend the Methodist College. Yeah! So all we need to say is good luck to all our players on the Fun House today. Yeah! Oh yes, we do need to say this as well. If you're playing at home, you will need three fun-filled games. Have you got time to get them ready? Because ours are all set up. They're worth 25 points to the winning team each time they win a game. Then we bring you back here. We ask you a question. If you get that right, you get another 25 points. And you don't have to get messy, which is uh, a lot easier than the games. However, that leads you on to the Fun Car Grand Prix. 25 points for the winning team and also 25 points every time you pick up one of those steering wheels on the way around. And then inside the Fun House for maybe the biggest prize ever on the show today on the Power Prize. We're really looking forward to it. And uh, you never know what it is. You'll find out a bit later from Gary, OK? So settle back and enjoy. Now, would you like to take them away and get them set? Because yes. uh, I don't know if those kids have got dogs at home or not. You got a dog there? Perhaps you got a dog sitting with you right now watching the show? Well, it's kind of interesting that all four kids are going to play this first game because it's to do with dogs and fleas. So you'd have thought it would be a fleesome, not a foursome. Come and see, anyway. My goodness, have you seen and have you heard the dogs? You've heard the dogs? Yes, yes, you can hear the dogs and you've seen this big dog here, OK? This big dog has very big fleas on it. Look at the size of this one. It's a bit of a worry, isn't it? I think I'll take this one with me. It's a bit too scary. But hidden deep down here are other coloured ones, reds and yellow fleas. They are inside the fur. It'll be your job as the vet. And your assistant may be helping you out here. I'm glad you've got these goggles on. Very important. Your job to go through here, which is disinfecting, to make sure that you're very clean. Grab one of these corresponding to your colour and then bring it back around your neck. And uh, your assistant could just help you out with some of this stuff, actually, which could be poured very, very nicely and very neatly over you to make sure that you are disinfected and nice and safe. So the dog will be clean, and you will be clean, and everybody will be happy. There's 45 seconds in this doubles game. It's most important you get as many fleas around your neck as you can. Play along at home as well if you've got any in the living room. On your marks, get set, go! <laughs> Your time is up. Your time is up. Move out of the way there. Most important. This guy's great, actually. We had a nice chat while the game was on there. We had a lot in common. Both little insects. So how do we get on here with the Reds? OK, we managed to get one, two, three, four, five. OK. Yay! Well done. So that's five fleas for the Reds, <laughs> which is much easier done than said. And over for the Yellows. We managed to get one, two, three, four. Yay! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> well done, Reg, you get the first points. Rerun the fun. Yeah. Well, as you know, blood is red, unless you're royal, supposedly, then it's blue. But the Reds draw first blood today. 25 points. Yeah. 
have a boys question. So if you're a girl and you're at home now, don't answer this, okay? Only for your brother. All right, here we go. Ready, boys? What is the plural of a mouse? Reds. Mice. Mice is right. Nice. Mice. Well done. Number 25. So yellows, zero. Reds, 50. OK, and uh, over here we have Jessica who has a top story about... Uh, you have a twin brother, don't you? Yeah, I do. What's, what's uh, your story about your twin brother? What's his name? Sebastian. OK. When I went to my school that I'm in now, I didn't tell my friends that I had a brother, and one of my friends went and asked my brother out for me. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So what was the result of that? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm sure Sebastian probably agreed as well, without a doubt. You know, brothers and sisters, like, especially twins. Twins, you don't, you don't fight, do you, twins at all? Oh, us? Yeah. No, we don't. You don't at all, do you? <laughs> it's amazing, these two, honestly. I've never seen a bad word between them in all this time. I do all the bad words for them. OK, <laughs> take everybody away and get them ready. It's okay, doubles sorry. games all round this afternoon on Funhouse. And this time, we're off to the coast with the most, the South Pacific. Because we're going to have a lot of fun in this game. It's down to the foam pit. Come on! I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Look what's been washed ashore here. After the storm, we have lots of fruit and more fruit and, and basically just fruit. So that means there must have been a terrible storm. You're right. So over here, on the masts, is the fruit that's left over on the ship. Yes, they were due to eat it, but uh, they've all been lost at sea. So that means that our islanders, who are busy, very busy dancing the hula hula at the moment, are looking very, very good there. Yeah, excellent. It'll be your job as islanders to climb over these rocks and to make your way out into the ocean to grab the fruit from the mast, to bring it back, to place it in your containers for you and your fellow islanders, OK? It's a key game as well, and because there's been a terrible storm, there may just be another one during the 45 seconds of this game. You never know. Funhouse style. OK, good score now, 75 each. And here's the question for the girls, all important, just ahead of the fun carts. This is very exciting here, very close game today. From the game, here is the question. What are you supposed to find at the end of a rainbow? A pot of gold. Yeah, you got it from the game. Well done, a pot of gold is right. Yellow 75, adds another 25. 100 yellows are ahead! <laughs> so the tables have turned. It is very exciting, it is very close. And the Fun Cart Grand Prix is next! <laughs> I think Mel may have been driving dangerously there with one hand. She was driving like this going, oh, yeah, she had two hands on the wheel. Very important that you keep two hands on the wheel. And very important you keep two hands on these wheels as well when you grab them, because when you pull them off their little, um, off their little strings, you've got to make sure you hold on to them in the go-karts, because quite often they do roll out and they fall out, and they don't count. They only count as 25 points if you bring them back to your assistant cheerleader, Melanie or Martina. So on the first lap, don't do any grabbing. On the fourth lap, don't do any grabbing. Just the third and fourth where you go for these. The other laps, you just go, hell for leather, try and get across the line as quickly as you can. OK, everybody understand? Yeah. Everybody happy? Yeah. I'm not talking to you two at the back there. I'm talking to our contestants. Are you all happy? Yeah. yeah. Who's going first? I am. Girls are? Yeah, OK, no problem. So you ready for action? Jump to your carts, prepare yourselves. Yeah. You guys are already ready to stand up, aren't you? Look at you, I can't believe it. We have the checkered flag here. But that won't be used until lap four. I'll hold on to that. You guys watch the lights and cheer nice and loud. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, go!
even though the yellows seem to cross the line first, I'm not sure if they crossed the whole line, so it may be a red win. Let's check it out now with our action replay. <laughs> So there we have it, just as I thought, exciting stuff. You've got to get the whole car across the line, not just a bit of the car. So the reds, you get the points. 25, you did it! Yeah! OK, now it really is exciting stuff here as we add up the amount of steering wheels and convert them to points. Martina, over you go, first of all. Let's hear that magic sound. <laughs> just the one, yeah? Just the one. OK, still worth 25. Well done, yellows, now for the Reds. This is so exciting today. Who's going into the fun house? Mel, do your stuff. <laughs> Just the none. None. Reds, 100. Yellows, 125. You've done it. You're going in. <laughs> that was exciting at the end there, wasn't it? Because you, you know, you had trouble there. You thought you'd won the race as well, and then you didn't, and all sorts of things going on, and you were back in the game, and then you took it over, and then the first one thought of the first number they took away, and... Oh, sorry, we're still on. OK, this is for you, by the way. Um, basically, we got... It's a pleasure. One of those out there in a box for you as well, and one for you as well. So thank you very much for playing. Would you like a Funhouse hat and a Funhouse fleece? Yeah. There you are. Beautifully modelled by Melanie, so we'll make sure you get those. Can't buy them in the shops. Thanks for playing, Reds! Give them a cheer! Yeah! So, you finally did it. Bit nerve-wracking at the end? Very. But you think you can go through with the final bit? Yes. Yeah. Want to know what's in the funhouse? Yes. OK. Yes. Gary <laughs> King has the details. You guys, come and join us! Yeah! Dip into the sunken well and take home this boredom buster. Blaze through the ball run to win membership to this fab fan club. Follow the flying fox and pick up a camera for some snappy shots. Or root around the snake in the box to lift some super stationery. Figure out the fireman's pole to make off for some crazy candy. Travel through the cruel tube for some racy rucksacks. Make it up at the bobsleigh to get the model makes. Tackle time at the big drop and grab for a cool clock. Box clever at the A-frame with some awesome art. Or top the climbing net and keep busy with these radical reeds. Wheel through the danger net to get hold of some speedy skates. Take on the tall tower and pick up a funhouse goodie bag. Leap the giant steps and get wet wearing a water watch. Or bash through the balloon run to take home some bright bugs. And down the wild slide for you and your pals to play a groovy game. A sparkling list of prizes, each one corresponding to a prize tag. There's 15 of them in total inside the funhouse, all hidden in different places. This is a uh, pretty empty prize tag, no prize for this. But one of the prize tags corresponds to the power prize this week. Gary, what is it? Forget the postman, get in touch with your mates anywhere in the world by email with this Ace laptop and snazzy printer. Yay! Wow, your own printer and your own laptop computer? Fantastic. One each for you up for grabs here. Top prize. Let's show everybody at home where it's hidden. OK, the only way you'll know if you've got that tag is when it makes this sound. <laughs> Who's going to be going first? Yes. You're okay in two minutes, yeah? Yep. Okay, now listen, before you go, what sort of prizes are you going to be after in there today? The Casio watches mm -hmm. and the Power Prize. Mm -hmm. I quite like the groovy bugs and the Power Prize as well. Yeah? Okay. Quite like the groovy bugs. So we'll see how you get on. If you make a groovy trip, you could be picking up on all 15. I think we've got 15, have they, Tina? Um, no, no, I don't no. know. I That's 12, though. 12 people have got, so it's pretty good. One foot on the step, luck, one foot on the ground. Two minutes and make that sound. Power prize noise we're after. Good luck, my friend. Go! Yeah!
has been run, uh, so let's see how many prizes they have done, all right? right there. We're going to start these off right away here. We've got the Funhouse goodie bag, OK? Come a little closer here so you can see exactly what you've got. Funhouse goodie bag, the cool clock, the racy rucksack, the groovy games, the speedy skate, the bright bugs. Is that what you wanted, yeah? The snappy shots. The water watches. Yep, you wanted those. Crazy candy. Awesome art. That's good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ten, nine. Well, a lot. Well done. Yes. And. And I did hear that power prize. Well done for grabbing the tag. So come on, Mel. Bring on the question. Good luck. Big moment here. I wish I had a laptop computer. I don't. I got a normal one, but I'm saving up for a laptop. You can get one each and your own printer. If you get this right, confer in 10 seconds. Don't blurt it out. Name three colours of the Italian flag. Red, white and green. Yes! Yeah! That's clever you. I didn't know that at all. I would have said spaghetti colour. That's brilliant. We've got more Funhouse winners and you're looking at them. See you next week. Bye-bye.